was sitting here editing this video and I realized I did not do an intro to the video. So this is a completely different day. It's actually like a month later because <laughs> I've been procrastinating on editing this video. But I just wanted to give you guys a room tour of Cohen's nursery because I realized who is literally right here below me playing with toys. But I realized that I had not done a nursery tour and um, his room is my favorite room in the house. It's so cute and cozy. Um, it is the smallest room. So we just made do um, with what we had. We have another room, but it has a guest bed in it. And we wanted to be able to have that room open for a homeschool room one day or a playroom. So we didn't do anything with um, the big room, we kept it for all those things. So the small room um, is Cohen's room. We love it, it's perfect. He obviously doesn't play in it. And that's why we wanted the bigger room so that he had like more of a playroom and we didn't have to keep a bunch of toys where he sleeps. Um, so let's just get right into the video and I hope you guys enjoy. First up in Cohen's sweet little room, we have this adorable, arrow decor piece he loves to look at that and that was the whole reason my mama got it then i'm obsessed with this little table when i found it at ross i knew it was the perfect piece for his room it adds just the right amount of rustic the little fox was a decoration piece at his baby shower that sweet little ultrasound picture was the only ultrasound we had of him so i love it the little noah's ark piece is a little um, gift item from my grandma which will go with him forever this sweet little rocker i actually ro rocked my preemie niece in it's a hand-me-down from my sister and that sweet little blanket was gifted to us after our sweet guy was here then over here we have these bookshelves, which I get so many questions about. They are from Ikea and they are so inexpensive. Um, and we had these little twinkle twinkle little star and I love you to the moon and back um, signs were actually some decor at our gender reveal. Super fun to incorporate that in there. We have so many books because at our baby shower, we did books instead of cards which is so fun to do. The little bear rug is, um, it was a gift to us. And then the blue rug is from Marshalls. It's so soft and it's really easy to spot clean. This crib was a hand-me-down as well. It was mine and my sister's crib, which is so fun to have in his room. And my niece used it as well. The adorable little quilt my sweet aunt made us. And I love it because it can grow with Cohen into his toddler bed. Then a sweet girl at our church brought my vision to life with these pictures. I wanted something different than I had seen online. Um, something more unique and personal and she drew those. She is such an artist. All of the signs above what should be his little changing table um, were either a decoration at a baby shower or it is from Hobby Lobby. Then we have his laundry basket. We have a basket right there that holds all of his bath time stuff so it's easy to access. Then his bibs and burp cloths and passies. We keep his diapers on here, his wipe warmer of course, and then his jammies and sleep sacks are easy to access so that my husband doesn't go scrambling for them because men, am I right? <laughs> and his drawer is a disaster because no matter how many times I fold it, we dig through to find something and it becomes a disaster. We put this sweet little sign right outside of his door so that every day as he grows up, he will remember who goes before him and I just love it. I finally got his closet organized and I'm so thankful for it being organized. It makes me feel so much better. That's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching.